Hi everyone, it's Lucy and welcome to my channel. Iron deficiency is the most common and widespread deficiency and contributes to death and disease worldwide. It's the only nutritional deficiency that is so prevalent in industrialized countries so everyone, even you, has a chance of being deficient. Which is why I put together a list of 8 foods that are really high in iron that can help you. First, I'm going to talk about the health benefits of iron. So first, why is is iron important? Iron is a mineral that has many important biological functions. Most of the iron in your body is found in your red blood cells which contain a protein called hemoglobin. This protein transports oxygen in your blood to all of the organs in your body and it couldn't function without iron. Some of your body's iron is also stored in the form of ferritin but these stocks are low and can easily be depleted if you don't get enough iron. Also, iron helps convert nutrients into energy and also plays a role in neurotransmission which is the communication between nerve cells. Again, if you're interested in reading the sources for this video, Video, you can check out my blog post I'll put it in the description so if you don't consume enough iron you could be heading into an iron deficiency here are the signs of iron deficiency to watch out for basically if you aren't getting your daily iron intake then you won't have enough healthy red blood cells to transport the oxygen to the organs in your body and this is anemia this condition will leave you feeling exhausted and very energy deprived another sign of iron deficiency is a change in skin color. Since hemoglobin is responsible for the red blood cells red color, low levels of iron, so low levels of hemoglobin, will make your skin less red. Dry skin and hair could also be a sign of iron deficiency because basically when your body is deficient in certain nutrients, it preserves them for the essential body functions and so hair and skin kind of receive less. In addition, if your eye iron deficient, you might also experience shortness of breath because your muscles will probably not be getting enough oxygen. Finally, there are other symptoms that you can experience and that aren't very fun. So now finally, here's the list of eight foods that are rich in iron. So first I'm going to start with animal sources of iron. Animal products contain heme iron, which is absorbed more efficiently in your body. Oysters contain a lot of iron. 100 grams of oysters can cover 67% of your daily iron needs. And the same thing goes for mussels. Both shellfish are also rich in vitamin B12, manganese, zinc, copper, and in health the omega-3 fatty acids, but their only downside is their potential for toxins and mercury. Liver is also rich in iron. 100 grams of liver gives you over 30% of your daily need. And also, other organ meats are very high in iron. Liver also more than covers your daily needs for vitamin B12, vitamin A, and vitamin B2. However, it also exceeds your daily needs in cholesterol, so watch out for that. 100 grams of beef gives you around 12% of your daily value in iron. It also covers half of your daily needs in protein. However, it contains high amounts of cholesterol and omega-6 fatty acids which can cause inflammation. Now on to the plant-based products. So plant-based products contain non-heme iron which is absorbed less efficiently by your body. Therefore vegans and vegetarians should consume more iron to get in the recommended daily amount. While you eat iron rich foods it's also important to eat foods rich in vitamin C which can help increase iron absorption. And also calcium can actually reduce your iron absorption so try not to consume calcium with iron rich foods. The same goes for coffee and tea which contain high amounts of polyphenols and while these are great for your health they're just not great for your iron absorption. So now that you know that here are some great plant sources of iron. The first one is spinach. For around 100 grams of spinach you get 20% of your daily needs. This vegetable also exceeds your daily need for vitamins A and K and it's a great source of fiber, vitamin B9 and manganese. Legumes also contain iron. Lentils, beans and chickpeas are amazing sources of nutrients especially for vegans and vegetarians. 100 grams of lentils gives you 19% of your daily value in iron. 100 grams of cooked black beans and pinto beans gives you 12% of your daily value in iron. And 100 grams of cooked chickpeas and red beans gives you 
16% of your daily value in iron. Legumes are also rich in fiber, protein, B9, and manganese. 100 grams of tofu, which is a soy-based food, covers around 30% of your daily value in iron. Tofu is also a great source of calcium, protein, and manganese. However, it is rich in omega-6 fatty acids. Just one ounce of dark chocolate covers 19% of your daily needs in iron. Dark chocolate is also very high in magnesium, manganese, and copper. However, it's also high in saturated fats. And another food that is super rich in iron is spirulina. Just one ounce of it will give you 44% of your daily needs in iron. And it's also an important source of protein. And if you're not a fan of the seaweed, then you can get it in powder form or in tablet form. And I'll have options for that in the description box. So now you can pick some foods from this list and get your daily iron needs met. However, I do have to warn you that getting too much iron is also not great for your health. Normally, you have very little iron that is freely circulating in your bloodstream. So if you consume too much, the levels can rise and this can cause oxidation, which can damage your cells. An overload in iron, specifically heme iron, has also been linked to cancer. And finally, too much iron can alter our natural resistance against infection. So to sum up, iron is a very important mineral and needs to be consumed in sufficient amounts for good health. But like many nutrients, getting too little or too much of it can be harmful. Look out for the signs that may point to an iron deficiency and use this list of iron-rich foods to meet all of your iron needs. Thank you so much for watching. Don't hesitate to subscribe if you like this video and hopefully see you on my next one. Bye!